Hello everyone. In this video, I'm going to show you how to download pictures from a Smug Mug site. As you can see here, this is my Smug Mug website. Smug Mug uses the concept of galleries to organize photos. Uh, I have galleries up here. I also have event, which events are also galleries. Now you can click on those and it opens up a view so you can see all the images within the gallery. For this example, I'm going to go over to another gallery that I have. As you can see, you have the small thumbnails of the photos on the left side with a larger image on the right. As you look up here, you have a couple options. One is slideshow, which is going to show a slideshow of the images in the gallery. You also have an option of download all. Now this option may or may not be available depending on the settings of the website. This is up to the site administrator to configure if they want to allow to download all or not. What this does is it will zip and allow you to download all the files, all the images at once by sending you an email with the link. You do need to enter in an email address to make this work. You also have the option to buy photos if you'd like. There's photos, prints, wall art, and keepsakes available. Some sites may also give you the option to download images for a fee. Now on the bottom here, there's an option to share. You can share photos, the whole gallery, it gives you some social media options, as well as a cart where you can buy photos. And then here is the download link. So to download this image, you have two options. You can either right click and some places in, in here is save image, save picture as right there. That feature may be disabled depending on how the administrator set it up. Also, I've got a download button here. If you click that, it's going to download this picture. I'm going to cancel out of there and I'm going to click on this image now. If I click on the image, I get a little bit of a bigger photo. Down here I have the option to download it again. I also have these little boxes which represent different sizes. So I can click on that and it will show the different sizes available for me to download. This is configurable by the site administrator. They may only have smaller, medium or other sizes available. Some sites won't allow you to download the larger versions. One thing to notice on each size that I select here, the watermark is going to show. That's with the exception of the original. On the original, there is no watermark. The watermark is left off the original version in the event you want to print it out at home or send it to another printer uh, to have the print made. That's all there is to it. I hope you enjoyed this and found this useful. Thank you for watching.